guys, hey guys, hey guys, this is Vaughn Rider. Welcome back to Well Done. I have done the most lamest repair ever on this house. I just filled it with dirt so this poor guy can stay in there. I'm <laughs> sorry, dude, I don't even have... I can't even pick up that door for you or this brain. So, I'm sorry. I want to check out this village up here. And it's still daylight. It's about midday, so I want to get over there really quickly and check it out. I don't know if I'm going to stay here or not, but there's a chance that I could, at least for a little bit, so I can uh, reorganize some of the things in my inventory. These these blaze rod things are pretty cool. That's pretty gross looking. This kind of reminds me of the original spawn. Before we reached the map, it was all kind of in a... <laughs> it was all kind of in this kind of biome with stone mountains, and I don't think there was a village, though. Uh, I don't know if anybody's even here. I thought I, you would think there would be villagers here, but I don't see anyone. Hello? Hello? Anybody home? Interesting. Oh, there's someone and a chest. I want to check out the... <laughs> That's where everyone is. That's amazing. Wow. <laughs> They're so panicked, too. Look at them. The poor things. The poor stupid things. Come on. I'll let you out. Yeah, you can get out now. There you go. <laughs> Villagers are so dumb. I've probably just consigned them all to death, actually. Like, if I left them in there, they probably would have lived longer. This is kind of weird terrain. Interesting. Okay, here's a blacksmith. There's usually goodies inside of these things, right? Do -do -do Ooh, a bronze helmet, thomium, obsidian, rubber tree. Nice. This is all good stuff. Um, hmm. I think we're gonna set up shop here for a little bit. I don't know that I'm gonna live here, but I'm carrying around so much stuff that I need to really just like organize and I want to keep that on me and this seems like as good a place as any to organize so I'm gonna dump everything oh. <laughs> was that guy flying that was really weird I feel like I just saw someone fly over my head oh maybe he was up there and okay well I want to finish <laughs> you can't get in that house man this this train generation is special. There you go. Now you can get in there. But I'm going in first. Do, 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 do. Why is there... Is that supposed to be like that? Is there supposed to be like... Smooth down in the middle of this house? Gotta admit, that's weird. These guys look like they're ice skating, don't they? <laughs> oh, villages! Now, is that chest the one that I saw? The same one that I saw? Is this... I don't think this is the same chest. Is it? Okay, it is. <laughs> I can tell things, I swear. Oh, I'm lagging. Well, I think it's the server that's lagging. Alright, well, I'm going to explore this. I'm going to set up. I'm going to... Look at this poor guy. There's a whole bunch of villains down there. <sighs> yeah, I'm going to I'm gonna explore. I'm going to... I don't know. I don't know if I want to stay in a place that... Oh, wow, it keeps going. And... is full of... This is quite a large village. Okay, I'm gonna... Wait a second. Okay. <laughs> I thought his house just ended. Man. It's a toss, though. This guy was like, I want a view. Okay, obviously things are not loading right, so give me a second. Sometimes it really feels like these villages are, like, broken. Like... <laughs> wheat fields? Like, why are they way up there? I know that some of it is related to, like, just making the land fit around the things, but that just looks dirty. Look at this guy. You're wearing a yellow. What is a yellow dude? Ooh, apiary. Oak woods. That's like bee. Ap apiaries or bee, bee related. Ah! Hi. <laughs> B 
be related things. That is some really dark land. Like, I think it would be kind of fun to live around here a little bit, except for the fact that um, I would have to light up so much of this to keep it safe for the villagers if I don't want them all to die horribly. I don't really want to do that. And like, look at these stupid wheat farms. Like, I get why sometimes, like, like this house, I get why this house is generated this way, because it generated up there, and it just filled in all the way down. But why... Whoa. Just heard a bunch of zombies dying. What? What the heck? <laughs> what the heck? There must be a... Is there a... Is there a spawner down here? That was too weird. Why were there three zombies in here? Were they just... Oh man, this game. This game, you guys! This game. So why do these... Hello, dog. Why did these spawn way up here? That's what I want to know. How would you ever even get up to this wheat farm? Seriously? 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 This is ridiculous. Somebody needs to be fired. Whoever designed this needs to be fired. Dang it! Come on! This is ridiculous! I'm still not there! Wait, did I climb up the wrong side? What? Oh, they're over here. Well, the dog got up here. <laughs> so there are crops up here. Way up here! I guess this will keep them from getting trampled. And they're covered in snow. Wow. This this whole area is pretty cool. It's like... What is this biome called? Why am I not seeing it? Alpine. Interesting. So it's very, like, a mountain area. Not very green, though. There's no grass at all. It's just dirt. If you wanted grass, you would have to go a ways and, and get... Is that... Is that like a giant... That right... There's that a giant? Not a giant. A, I keep forgetting I don't have ender pearls. Uh, oil thing. How am I gonna get down from here? Man, look at that hole. You will die. You will die. I don't know how to get down. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. Oh my god. How am I supposed to get down from here? Seriously? Did these do these dogs must have just spawned up here? There's just no way down. This is this is it. I spend the rest of my life up here. I'm trapped for eternity. Is that just dark or is it not loading? It's just dark. Wow, that looks like I feel we've made it. We're in the farlands. Look at those pigs. This whole I can't even, and it's getting dark. You know, okay. You know what? I don't know that I'm going to live here, but I am going to build a bed, and I'm going to sleep here. And we're just going to we're gonna call it good, but not in here. I want to go back to where I put my stuff, assuming I can ever find that place again. Little village dude, you need to go inside. Alright, so I will, I will come back to you guys probably in the morning, unless something amazing happens. Oh, that's a nice set, setting sun. Alright, I have spent quite a, wa a while in this village. I've lit up most of it. I haven't necessarily saved all of the villagers, but I have saved a lot of them. Uh, I've got two squared away in my house that I... the... What is the thing that I lived in? The blacksmith. Yeah, this little building here. I've got two hidden away in there, just in case everybody else dies. There will always at least be two villagers relatively safe inside of that house. I'm sure that a lot of them have already died. Uh, I haven't seen the apiary since I moved in. There are a couple other villagers that are like hidden. Not hidden, but like this guy is trapped in here. Like His door was generated with, with the door hidden or inaccessible. In, 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 inaccessible? 
So he can't get out. He's been in there this entire life. And I think this guy is the same situation. No, I think I may have unburied him. Yeah. I gave him a little platform. That was what his was. His was over this overhang, so he couldn't get out. Uh, you'll also notice that I have built a generator, so I've got a jetpack again. I do not have anything fancy, but I'm living in here. I've expanded this way just so that I've got a little more space because this is where the house was and you know how these rooms come like this it was tiny so I've got two villagers in here I'm kind of hoping that eventually at one point I will get them both in here and I can just wall them in and forget about them and in case I don't know emergency I've done a little caving so I've got some supplies here and I've got some stuff here uh, mostly just to get the generator so that I can get my jetpack going up again. And that's good. I found, oh, I did, I found a dungeon, a zombie dungeon, and I got the bronze helmet, and it also had a portal gun in it, which was pretty cool. I don't know how that works, but <laughs> I would have never made one of those, but now I have one. That's something. And it had cocoa beans and, of course, the mossy stone in a bucket. So... Woohoo! It's exciting. But one of the things that I, I noticed while I was out and about, okay, so I've done a lot of lighting up. Uh, how do I get this out of hover mode? I forget. Is it M? Oh, there we go. Ah! Okay, so uh, one of the things I noticed while I was lighting things up, and I think we noticed it before I broke away too was I thought I saw like an oil slick like on top of a mountain let me find that and I'll bring you guys back alright so there it is it is indeed an oil uh, thing on the top of this mountain which I thought was kind of weird <laughs> just way up here but it worth noticing there are a lot of dogs in this area like not just dogs but like entire herds of dogs so is this the same? Yeah. So it just spills down the side there. That's kind of gross, but interesting. Uh, one of the other things... I've done a lot of lighting up in this area. Uh, there's lots of weird overhangs, which are both cool and weird. I like it, but I don't know that I would ever want to live here. But like all under here, this was all just pitch black, both with lighting glitches and with just shadows and stuff. That's not even the big one. I don't even know where the other one is, but there's a huge one somewhere, and this is just a weird lighting glitch. Just lots and lots of overhangs. Is this it over here? This might be it over here. No? This is just a cave. Oh, is that a cow? Hey, I didn't even know there was cows over here. Oh, man, look at this. I've done so much lighting up, and there's still entire areas that I haven't lit up. Because if I would lit this up already, I would have grabbed that copper. Yeah, I think copper just does not spawn very naturally in uh, twilight forests. <laughs> but anyway, this... Somebody just... Oh, that's a pig. Oh, I thought somebody just died, but nope. It's just red pig. Alright, and then one other thing I noticed was back over in the desert where that uh, volcano was. So I'm going to head that way, and I'll bring you guys back in when I get over there. Alright, so there's our village there. This is where that house is that I blew up with the creeper. And if you go in this direction... Uh, I just noticed it once. I didn't go over there and investigate, but... Bum -ba -da -da. See? A desert temple! So that's going to be fun to explore. It's funny because that is usually pretty exciting <laughs> in Ranella, but in Feed the Beast, it feels almost old. Like, it's not part of the mod, so I'm kind of like, oh, well, I know it's in there. It's boring. Mm -hmm. Although, I am still excited, and that looks pretty cool over there. So this whole area is really interesting. Um, I still don't know that I'm going to live here, although I've... S oh, it looks like this one may have already been explored. Which is surprising to me. I didn't think that anybody had been over here. But this definitely... Why would you explore this and not light it up, though? But this definitely looks explored. Huh. Aw. Well, they 
they left me a bronze helmet, thanks. And nuggets and an iron helmet. But they took everything else. Well, I want to know who took it. Who, who's been out this way and didn't... Didn't do anything with that village? Or maybe they came last night after... After I put my video up, I don't know. In fact, you know what? I want these chests, too. Well, that was, that was anticlimactic. I thought I was going to find something cool. Oh, there goes my uh, pick. Dang it. But I do have enough materials now to make another pick, so that's good at least. Or not my pick, axe. Oh, wow. <laughs> that looks cool. Um, Is that like a legitimate volcano? Because that looks so much cooler than, than the little derpy one that I saw over there. Wow. And look at this guy in his gold armor. It's huge. I don't know what they're talking about, but it's funny to think that they're talking about what I'm looking at. Because that looks like a legitimate volcano, like tall and everything. Oh, I've started a, a chicken farm as well because I am low on arrows. Look at this guy. Didn't even drop anything. Oh man, look at this thing. That's gorgeous. That is that is how a volcano should look. That is how a volcano should look. Now, I don't know what I would do with this volcano, but it looks awesome. Like, I don't know that I would live in a volcano like this. I wouldn't want to damage it or make it not look awesome. <laughs> but that's nice. Oh, there's a house and a portal. So somebody lives here. Dang it. I wonder who this is. I know that the nether doesn't work anymore either because uh, we've we've had to delete that and, and redo it. I wonder if they've left a sign. I wonder who this is. And I wonder if, if he made that portal or if that's... or she. Here is a block from the nether. Ooh, netherrack. <laughs> I want to know who this is. How do I get inside your house, man? Do you have a door? This is the cool thing about being on a server is you just run into people like this. Seriously, do you have a door? How do I enter your house? You must have a way to get in and out. I see windows, but I don't see a door. Well, there's always this way. Oh man, look at all the crap in here. I'm visiting somebody's house. Wow. There is a lot of stuff in this house. There is a lot of stuff in this house. Somebody is... And there's an axe on the floor. Holy cow. And the candle. Um, I don't want to take your axe. Is that my axe? That's my axe. That's my axe coming back. Up, down, nether rack deposit. Okay, but who are you? Whose house is this? I'm, I'm confused. Just this is cool. There's like a paper, and that doesn't look very Minecraft though. I like these jars. This is like a rainbow room. I don't even know what these do, but they look cool. Kind of want one just because they look so cool. What is this? Something in there. Can't tell. Who who are you? <laughs> and how come you don't have any doors to your house? Ah, I see. You've got the nice view of the volcano. It's a nice view, that's for sure. I don't know what these do. I don't know what that is. I don't know what this does. I have no idea how to get out of your house other than just breaking a hole. I don't want to touch anything. I'm afraid I will break it and it'll explode. I really kind of want to go in there, but I'm afraid. Seriously, there must be like some secret door button or something that I'm just... No? <laughs> I'm so confused. Okay, well, um, if you watch my videos and you see yourself on here, let me know who you are. I did not know that anybody was out here, so I will... Whoa. <laughs> I will definitely not be living in that village if somebody lives this close to that village. 
But you have a cool looking place. Uh, wow, yeah, it's really close to that village. So, um, enjoy your amazing volcano, and I will, uh, I'll leave you be. Wait a second, is this, is this a different village? No, this is my village, isn't it? I just haven't lit it all up. I don't remember this lava lake. This is a different village. What the frick? Wow. This is a completely different village, because there's... This is not mine. I'm so lost now. Uh-oh. I think I'm out of energy. Did my... Yep, my jetpack is out of jet juice now. Crap. How am I supposed to get up there? How do you climb in the old days of... Ow! Ow! No! Don't lag now! Whew. This is not good. This is not good, you guys. Look at this thing. It's not even giving off any light. Give off light! Well, now I want to know if he's been in that... Ah, I miss Ender Pearls! Do I don't have to build with. I have cobble. I'm going to ugly up this place. I'm sorry. Oh, yes. I've got lots of potatoes now, as you can see. Ah! All of the water in these uh, farms keeps freezing, so I had to do a little heavy-duty maintenance to make sure that I could still get them to work. This is dark as hell. Open! Oh, wow. There's tons of stuff in here. He has not been in here. Looting this village, man. You snooze, you lose. Yoink! All right. Well, that was exciting. Okay, well, I am going to make my way back home. <sighs> if I can remember how. And um, I will keep recording, so if something exciting happens, I will show you. But otherwise, I will see you when I get back. This poor guy. I am back in my base, or my temporary whole houseness. Uh, I've decided to move on, so what I'm going to do is probably end the episode. I have to figure out what of this stuff that I'm going to bring with me. I have a lot of stuff. There's no way that I can fit these two chests. Plus, I mean, obviously I can leave cobble and stuff, but that behind, chests behind, I've got to bring the generator. Uh, probably bring the bed. No, I'll leave the bed here in case I die and I can respawn out here instead of going back somewhere weird. But I've got to figure out what I want to bring. And I do have... Uh, I have some... No, let's see. I've got some blaze powder. And I've got some obsidian. So if I can get an ender pearl, I could make an ender chest. And that would help uh, increase the storage capacity that I'm carrying. But I also don't... I haven't seen any endermen. And those are kind of scary to kill. So I may play a little bit and see if I can kill an enderman and do that. But otherwise, I'm going to move on. So, if you guys have a suggestion as to what I should bring, absolutely you should bring, let me know. Otherwise, I will just figure something out on my own. And then maybe what direction I should go. We know that the volcano guy is that way, so maybe I should head this way, this way or something. You know, obviously not back toward spawn, but there's plenty of directions to go. So, that's my idea. I think I'm going to end the episode here. Sorry if it wasn't as hilariously funny as some of them are, but a lot of weird things happened anyway. So thanks so much for watching, you guys. Uh, maybe we'll have a giveaway next episode. So my name is Vaughn. See you next time.